Hey guys, Chad here from the Electric Academy. A uh, couple things I want to talk about today. First off, again, I'd just like to call attention, if you're looking for a free PDF of online resources for electricians, go to the top of the Facebook page and there's a link there that says, a little button that says learn more. Hit that and just sign, give me your email there and I will send you that PDF. It's awesome. I'm getting lots of downloads on it and lots of good um, feedback on it. If there's anything you think I should be adding to it, let me know. And today I just want to talk a little bit about what my vision is for the Electric Academy. And I'm not going to get too much into it. I just want to let you guys know where I'm coming from. A lot of you guys are new to the show here. So I just want to let you know who I am, what my whole business is. And, well, actually I don't even have a business, so there's that. Well, I do, but it has nothing to do with this online stuff. Anyways, the Electric Academy, it's a blog I started a few years ago. Well, three years ago now. And I teach at a vocational college. I teach electrical apprenticeship. And I found that there was a lot of students that were struggling with, with uh, the theory. So what I thought I would do is I enjoy teaching and I felt like I had a good way of sharing my information. So I started making these little tutorial videos and I started posting them on YouTube and then I started posting them on my blog. And that's how the Electric Academy was born. I wanted to have some sort of resource for electrical apprentices. Then of course I got onto Facebook and I started building this community. And it has been an unbelievable ride. I have learned so much. You guys have been so awesome to deal with. Uh, the interaction that you have in the group, this is being posted on my Facebook page, the business page, but there's also an Electric Academy Facebook group where you guys are asking questions, getting jobs, sharing uh, information, sharing pictures. It's an awesome, awesome interactive group. Make sure that you get over there and check it out. Uh, so that's kind of my, my thing, my jam is, I really, really like to help electrical apprentices. And I've been doing it now for three years. I've been teaching for eight, and I just want to keep growing it. So right now, my website's going through a whole redo. I'm getting it redesigned by a professional designer. I'm super excited about the way it looks and how it's going to work out. And I just want to double down on all this, and I've just been having so much fun with it. So that's why I've been doing the Facebook Live videos every day. I just have so much fun doing it. I've been getting a lot of good feedback on it. So that's where I'm coming from. Some of you guys I've talked to online, and if you are getting something from this. Maybe add something in the comments that you've really enjoyed or you've liked or you've learned. Um, like this, share it. Please get the word out there for the Electric Academy because we all know that as apprentices, it's hard. It can be hard. And that leads me to my big point of my talk today is I was watching this um, on Facebook, this video popped up and it really resonated with me. Basically, the whole gist of the, the thing is don't constantly compare yourself to others. And this is especially for you apprentices out there. The big thing is do not compare your day one to somebody else's day 20. I love that quote because you guys are just getting started in this and it can be hard, man. It can be brutally hard. I know with my foundation, I've got, I teach this um, level or entrance trades program. So these guys come to me and then we send them out into the field. They finally get a job. They will all say that the first few weeks is the hardest work they've ever done and it's super duper hard. The first year is hard. I know for my apprenticeship, it wasn't the easiest first year but it is so worth it. It is 1000% worth it. I highly recommend being in this trade and just remember that it's going to be hard. And if you look back on my, if you go to my blog at www.theelectricacademy.com, there's a post there and it's called, This Too Shall Pass. We might wanna take a look at that. I talk about how it, it is hard at the beginning, but it totally gets better, it gets easier. It's an awesome, awesome trade. I cannot say how much I love this trade enough. And it leads to other things, like it's a building stone, it's a stepping, steps into other things. Like I, because I got my trade, which I never really meant to get in the first place, it was just something I wanted to do for a summer, I ended up working for this greenhouse control system, learned all that, which was super duper interesting, getting into automation. I went up to Fort McMurray and got into industrial, which was super awesome. I uh, ended up being a project manager, site supervisor. I ended up being an operations manager for a construction company, a large construction company, an awesome company, Centurion. I just kept growing and growing and growing and then now I teach. And then from that, I've gone on to teach entrepreneurship for trades. I'm doing this Electric Academy thing. It's such an awesome thing and I would never have done it had it not gotten my trade. So I cannot encourage you guys enough. Get out there and get an electrical trade or get any kind of trade. If you agree with what I'm saying, hit a like button on that. That'd be awesome. Um, so yeah, that's just what I wanted to say. It's not gonna be a long one today. I just want to say, remember, do not compare your day one to somebody else's day 20. It will get easier. If you're having issues or questions or anything, get in the group. Let me know. 
Uh, you send me an email, man. I've had lots of guys email me, chad at theelectricacademy.com. And there's some guys that I'm talking to constantly online. Send me a message through the Facebook page. Just get out there and realize that you are not alone. In this day and age, now that we are all online, you don't have to worry about just the guys you're working with. You can talk to anybody. You can reach out. And I am constantly on my phone, much to the chagrin of my wife and family sometimes. But if you want to send me a message, I promise I will get back to you as soon as possible. If you're struggling with things, let me know. If there's things that you'd like to learn or you want me to post about, let me know. If there's tutorial videos you'd like me to make, please let me know. My whole purpose for Electric Academy is to help you guys out. All right, that's it. That's all my little shinding for today. Remember, check out that PDF. So you might want to just remember again, go to the top of the page there, hit the learn more button, get that downloaded. Let me know. Check out the website, www.theelectricacademy.com. Check that out. If there's any tutorial videos you want, let me know. Send, last me a private message if you uh, have any questions at all or any kind of tutorials. Like I said, there's a few guys that I'm talking to. Steve, you know who I'm talking about right now. Constantly in discussion with these guys. I learn just as much from you guys as you're learning from me. And uh, that's about it. Keep your eyes open on the website. I will let you know when it launches. Hopefully it'll be pretty soon. I think we're gearing up for like a September release. And there's lots of other cool things coming down the pipe. Again, as always, guys, just work safe out there today. Have a great day. And, you know, it's Friday, so I probably won't be posting much this weekend unless something crazy happens. Like last weekend when I was in Whistler and the power went out. It was a neutral problem for those of you guys who are just checking in. And check back on the other videos. Yesterday I did an awesome one on, well, awesome. I'm so awesome. There was a one that I posted about what's in my toolbox. It's getting lots of guys talking about their favorite tools. So pop by and take a look at that. All right, anyways, have a good day. Might see you this weekend, probably not. We'll definitely see you on Monday. Have a great day, guys. Work safe.